Welcome to the Five on Five. Today I'm joined here by Emily Anton, a dancer, a ballet dancer, and the artistic director Marilyn Claus with Ballets with a Twist. Mm -hmm. And they're here to talk about this exciting signature show, Cocktail Hour. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. So this Cocktail Hour is an exciting thing. It's happening in the Rogue Valley. Emily, this is a little bit of a homecoming for you in the, at the Criterion Theater. Explain that to us. Well, I went to high school at Ashland High um, and then went all over the country training with ballet. And then three years ago, I came to New York City and said, OK, I'm going to make it professionally. And I did. And um, a year or two later, I auditioned for Ballets with a Twist. They accepted me and been performing with them ever since. And I can't imagine that it would be easy to do all that. What was it like working up the ranks? Really hard, I think. <laughs> but somehow it was like the only thing that I thought possible. It's like, OK, this is just what I'm doing. And kind of looking back even now, like with this homecoming being like, wow, I've really had a remarkable journey. And I've had like a lot of people saying no. No, like, this is impossible. Like, how can you, you know, it's very hard to be a professional ballet dancer, especially. Why is it so hard? There's not a whole lot of contracts out there. There's not a whole lot of companies that are working. Um, sadly, ballet isn't hugely popular with audiences, even though I think it's remarkably gorgeous. And I tried, I pursue, you know, everyone that I meet, I'm like, Ballet's pretty awesome. <laughs> Just, you know, you should go to performance. Check it out. <laughs> and you'll be having a pretty remarkable performance. Marilyn, can you explain to me what this signature show Cocktail Hour is? Cocktail Hour is a show that really appeals to a broad audience. Um, I've been dancing my whole life. I retire from the stage now. Uh, but my father was an incredible ballroom dancer, and so I lived in Hollywood, California, and I absorbed all the lessons of movies and I Love Lucy and Ricky Ricardo's Copacabana, They're all their different shows. And I said, you know, Americans love dance. They watch dance on television. They love Fred Astaire. They love Gene Kelly. And so I absorbed all of that my whole life. And then when it came time for me to create a show, I said, let's, let's have a show that American people can relate to, that they're not going to be frightened of going in to watch swans molt on stage oh, for three gosh. hours. <laughs> and so this, is, this really gives the sense of the martini. You see the martini up on stage. She's James Bond's nemesis, Bond girl. Um, we have Shirley Temple up there for the children and Roy Rogers, oh mocktails. God. We have the gimlet. Um, we have champagne, Mai Tai. We, we go through all the different dances and, and all the different cocktails. And it's a cultural mix. It has this much to do with alcohol. Oh, gosh. We end up the show with a piece called Holy Water, which is about the spirit. You can't get any higher. Oh. That sounds exciting. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely exciting. Well, we'll be right back with much more about this show coming up this weekend at the Criterion Theater. Stay with us. Welcome back. Again, I'm joined here by Emily Anton and Marilyn Claus, the artistic director with Ballets with a Twist, presenting the signature show, Cocktail Hour. Emily, you're a professional ballet dancer. You grew up here, went to high school here in the Rogue Valley. What do you have for advice when it comes to aspiring dancers who want to do the same thing? Absolutely. I think my best advice would be any no you hear, just hear it as a maybe. <laughs> just a no right now. <laughs> just keep going. Keep trying. Keep going to auditions. Never give up on yourself. Wow. Inspiring. And your show this weekend is going to be inspiring where you're apparently going to be dancing the role of a Bloody Mary, which is going to be exciting. Marilyn, when people hear about this, what should they expect? Where can they see it? What time? What are the details? It's been said that Cocktail Hour blasts the boundaries between high art and entertainment. Uh, you can get tickets uh, at www.criterion.org. It's Saturday night, September 13th, 
and it's at 7.30. Perfect. Thank you so much for joining us. And good luck at the show. You're going to do great. <laughs> Stay with us. We'll be right back.